So I just want to go over this again because I really like Vortex Optics and I'm not trying to shit on my favorite manufacturer of optics. I got that Spitfire 1X Prism Scope, the Gen 1, love that optic. The Strike Eagle, I just told y'all about it. I am in love with that optic. That optic is perfect for me. But when it comes to that Venom, what Vortex decided to do was, and I understand why they did it, they're trying to compete with primary arms. So they made their reticle smaller. I don't know why they did it, but that's what they did. What you're looking at right now on your screen, at the top is the Strike Eagle that I have. At the bottom is the Venom that I just sent back. One of the hardest things to do is show reticle size and actually get a clear picture of a reticle with a phone. So what that means is, as you're looking at them two pictures, you can clearly see that that Venom is much, much smaller than that Strike Eagle. If you can notice that through a picture, then trust me, actually looking through the optic, you will see a difference. That Venom reticle has to be about 30 to 40% smaller than that Strike Eagle reticle and that just not working for me with the way my eyes are set up and I think most people will agree with what I'm about to say and if you know about shooting mechanics and all that stuff like that when it comes to the red dots I can work with a 3MOA even a 2MOA red dot because that gets bright enough that when you overlay that on a target you're still able to be threat focused with the Vortex Strike Eagle, with that big, easy to see reticle, the same thing applies. Because that reticle is so big and easy to see, it makes it target and threat focus extremely easy. Extremely easy. I'm telling you, that reticle is perfect. The perfect size for actual LPVO that goes on one power. It makes it so much more usable. When it comes to the Venom... And other optic companies who make smaller reticles, they get lost within the target. And because they're not daylight bright, it makes it hard to pick up where that reticle is on the target. So that's why me and my vision, I don't like small reticles. And I see that Vortex is going towards smaller reticles to compete with primary arms. Even in their prism scopes. I have the original Gen 1, but I'm hearing that the Gen 2, guess what they did? They made the reticle smaller. <clears throat> so I see that's kind of the direction that Vortex is going, and I don't like that. Now granted, that's just me and my vision and my preferences, but... That's why I had to send it back. That reticle was just too small for me to actually be able to use it. Like, they really made it small. Kind of like that uh, Cyclops reticle in the um, primary arms optics. Damn, they're the same size, too, as I think about it. <laughs> That's coincidental, but yeah. So, with me, I love that Strike Eagle. That 1 to 8 Gen 2, I love that reticle. I love that optic. I think what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to have to get the Strike Eagle. I'm tired of playing around. Just buy what I know that I like and what I've already had and what I've already run. And that's the Strike Eagle. So, that's it, man. It is what it is. So, for me, it's either, when it comes to LPVOs, it's either that Strike Eagle or I'm going with a red dot. Simple as that. Any other kind of optic, regardless from what manufacturer... Unless I can look through it and see if I like the reticle. And if the reticle is big enough for my vision, it's either going to be a Strike Eagle 1 to 8 Gen 2 that I already got. Or it's going to be a red dot. I'd be better off just going with a red dot. <laughs> for real. Just going with a red dot. But it is what it is though. I just kind of wanted to come back and just let y'all know. There's nothing wrong with the Venom. It's only the reticle with me. That's the only thing I don't like is that reticle. I hate that they made it smaller, but that's what they did, though. So that is something you may want to consider. Because the Strike Eagle is only going for 350 now. The Strike Eagle, 1 to 8 that I got right now, that when, I, when it first came out, I paid like 600 for it. Hold on for a minute. The video about to cut off. Wait a minute. Apologize about that. I ain't make the picture long enough, so the video was about to cut off right while I was talking. But yeah, man, I paid like $600 for that Strike Eagle 1 to 8 Gen 2. Now they got it for three fifty. That's only fifty dollars more than the Venom. So you might as well just get the Strike Eagle. It got the bigger the bigger reticle, better glass, more magnification. It gets brighter. 
you might as well just get the damn Strike Eagle. <laughs> it's literally $50 more on Amazon right now. I should have just fucking got the Strike Eagle. Oh, man. But it is what it is. I just wanted to share that with y'all, man. Y'all be blessed. Be safe, man. I'm out, man. Look like we'll be having another Wednesday next week.